Hello friends and welcome to the channel. I'm Hantington and today we're playing more Cookie Run Oven Break. It's been some time since I've been able to record this, hasn't it? <laughs> um, I've been exceptionally busy with projects, finals, and tests all being crammed in this last month of having lots of stuff to do. My father is barely ever out of the house to begin with, but especially now with Corona. Um, he went out of the house to mail a letter at the post office, and he's gonna go to the store, so I have a little bit of time to record this. So I don't want to try and lollygag too much. Um, I'm gonna see what I can do, but here's... Th th this whole update is a really cool thing. Um, we have apple cookie, we have another thing, uh, another cookie coming in. Um, I have yet to click on, excuse me, I have yet to do anything with the new dreamy cookie land event, which I think we're going to try and focus on, um, f uh, for, for this, uh, for this episode. Um, I accidentally clicked on it once, but then closed the game out of it, so hopefully we still get the cutscene. Um... I don't know. So, I've been I've been waiting and saving to uh, up to do this. Also, before I do that actually, I, I won the prize. It's Ginger Brave's gift. I earned a, a rewards from an event and I got the thankful cookie um set from Ginger Brave. So, yay. Thank you very much. So, yay. We're going to head over to the gacha as well. Because I have been saving up this rare cookie chest, which since we have all the rare cookies, uh, it's just money. So we get 320 cookies that just get c converted into money. So who are we gonna get? That's a lot of cash. That's way more cash. That's a ridiculous boatload of cash. There we go. Awesome. And now for the pets. Let's see, how much money shall we get? I love the look of the rare egg, because it looks like it's chocolate and mint, even though they're basically worthless to me at this point. But I got I don't remember where I had gotten it, but I got, had gotten a key for it. That's a lot of stars, and that's a lot of money for the stars. <laughs> Reach for the stars. Get paid for the stars. Also, I had done a costume draw off-camera, because I was like, all right, let me see what I'll get. I was able to get... um the Rose Court Swordsman, whatever guy, Raspberry, got his costume, and I got the, um, Squirrel Boy cookie, unicorn, the Pancake Cookie, who has gotten a buff. I got his unicorn outfit. I'm going to sneeze. Hold on. Let's try it again. Let's see what other costumes we get. Hopefully I don't get the unicorn again. Here's Ginger Brave. He's looking at the witch. There's a little glow. Oh, his friends are... Oh, no, it, they're, the, they're the friends. Yay! Friend time. Glimmer, glimmer in his eye. Jump off the thing into the royal arms. And then just like that sonic uh, sonic forces. Yeah, ba -da -ba -da -da, we can do. Yeah, ba -da -ba -da -ba -da 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 -da. We're gonna go launch Ginger Brave. This whole costume gotcha is so unbalanced. <laughs> I mean, I I am now I I remember what I said, I can't technically hate the costume gotcha after what it did with the cocoa cookie thing, but also I can still say that it's rather unbalanced to give a whole heck of a lot of these basic costumes um Early, which it's good early on in the game when you don't have too many costume duplicates, but if you bought a whole bunch of the costumes over time like I did and you already had a whole bunch of these, it just, it's so annoying. And it, it's not like the normal cookie gotcha where it's, um, it, it'll lean towards the cookies that you don't have instead. Um... No, it's just entire. It's entirely random, and there's a huge, huge chance that you will get the worthless costumes. <laughs> it's really annoying. So we'll see if we can get some good stuff out of this. Ooh, we got a purple. We got the good costume! Yay! 
I love this. The costume gotcha only gives me good things when I talk about how it's not good. <laughs> All right, well, getting at least one of these costumes makes it worth it to pull from the costume gotcha because it's only a little bit more expensive than buying one of these costumes. All right, we got the warrior tight costume. Where he's just, he's just like, I love this. He's adorable. And then there's Alchemist, and then there's the other... See, th this is what I'm talking about, where you just get so many of the useless ones. There we go. But we actually got a good costume out of this. <laughs> awesome. All right. <laughs> well, that's good. That's good, at least. Uh, let's see. Let's see. I don't want to pull from the one on the right, because I already have three of those costumes already. Um, let's see. I think I will probably wait again to do another special draw from this until the next cookie gets released. So this way there's a chance to get that costume, and then it'll be three out of five instead of two out of five like the other one. Um, but hey, we got the muscle cookie outfit. Awesome. Muscle cookie and adventure cookie got a boost in this. I have him set up for the jolly green giant outfit. But let's see, how much does that one do? 700 destruction, 300 destruction, and then this one is 2,000 kettlebell destruction. Hmm. I imagine this one is probably better. He has so many costumes. <laughs> this, is, this is the most innocent of the costumes that he has. It's adorable. <laughs> All right, we'll go with the warrior tyke. Go, child. Oh. We, we, we went out of that for a second. My dream, big muscles. But he already has big muscles, for even for a child. He has a sword, though, instead of the dumbbell, or the kettlebell. Interesting. Oh, yes! I forgot to mention! I saved up a whole bunch of play points, because I've been able to earn the ones that you get for free from downloading games, and I undownload them. And then I was able to get up to silver rank where I'm able to get some play points each week. So I had enough play points to afford getting just Cookie Droid. Not the pet, just Cookie Droid. Also, I was annoyed to find out, I was annoyed droid, to find out that apparently, um, Cookie Droid does not go away after the event. Uh, so I, I frantically bought Cookie Droid, only to find out, oh wait, Cookie Droid is now a permanent staple of the Google Play Store. So I don't have to worry too much about, um, missing out on Cookie Droid. And you can get Cookie Droid even after the event, it's just the trial, um, and one or two other things. So at least that's okay, that's good, that's not too bad. Um... So at least we're in the clear on that front. So I was able to earn enough to be able to afford Cookie Droid, which I'm happy about. Dev Sisters is extremely stingy on giving you special spirit potions, which you can also finally use to level up the Hello Kitties again. I don't know why they didn't give out special spirit potions. I've heard that when doing the Dreamy Dreamland event, you can get one regular spirit potion. I mean, one special spirit potion, which is annoying. <laughs> Because it's like, really? <laughs> Come on. But that's still okay, and I'm still glad, and I hope that in future events we'll be able to win special spirit potions from stuff, so it'll be, it won't just be this one time as a thing, but we might be able to earn them in the future. Also, I spent, I got the crystals back, I spent like 20,000 crystals trying to pull Cookie, Droid, and Play Block from the special cookie chests, was not able to get any of them. Extremely hard to get. Very annoying. I am annoyed with that. I still don't have the tr her trial unlock because I don't have her pet. But I can get the pet at any time, and the pet is a little bit cheaper to get with play points, so I might be able to do that eventually. Um, excuse me, but so far I wanted to also save leveling up Cookie Droid on camera. Where did everyone escape from the oven? Cookie Droid is awesome, and I love her, so this is still awesome. I love... She's, she's app game themed, and I already like app game themed stuff, so I like her. I don't think that she is obnoxious, or, or her design is annoying or anything. I just, I just like her. Um, so I'm very happy about this. Still a little bit annoyed with how tough it is to get her. Um, but I mean, Dev Sisters, I don't think I can really call this game little anymore. They now have a permanent feature on the official Google Play Store. 
for redeeming play points to be able to get the cookie as a, as just a permanent staple of the game. They've hit it. They they've reached the big time. They they're doing it. This is amazing. So I am very happy for Dev Sisters being able to do, uh, being able to do this. I just wish they were a little bit less stingy on it, but I mean, they're still better than a lot of other companies. So I'm still happy about that. And I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna say. Oh no, this is perfect. This is all good. No, no, they could do better, but they're still better than other companies that do similar tactics like this. I still like it. I to quote the Marge Simpson meme, which I've. I don't know why I've been extra obsessed with lately. Where she she just holds up the potato and goes, "I just think they're neat." That's what I think of Dev Sisters. I just think they're neat. So I I'm okay enough with this. Um but just remember to be kind to people, okay? Uh just just be nice. Don't don't try and harass other people over this. Let's just let's just enjoy this game for being a, being an awesome. So but there we go. Let's let's upgrade Cookie Droid. Yay! Burning day, time to run faster. Oh, she um she acknowledges it's the burning day. She's a, a meta cookie. She she knows what's going on. The map doesn't have rainbow cubes, does it? <laughs> okay, that's awesome. <laughs> I like that. That is awesome. Because everybody is always asking, can we get rainbow cubes from this, though? Like, from the jelly, the, the nice to meet you jelly set, I was even thinking in my head, I don't, I, don't, I didn't say it, but I was just thinking, couldn't we get rainbow cubes instead? Four rainbow cubes are better than four crystals. <laughs> I love that. I love that she asks if you can get rainbow cubes from this. <laughs> that is awesome. All right, that's I love that. Good, good on you, Dev Sisters. <laughs> and luckily, the the special ones only take one, two, or three to level up, so um, they don't take as much as the other ones. Where did everyone escape from the oven? She's now British. I, that's my headcanon voice for her. There we go. Why do the cookies run? To escape from the witch. And because of the gingerbread man story, which it's based off of. Why avoid the witch's house? Because you'll die. She eats cookies. You are naive, despite the fact that you are made out of numerous cookie parts. Uh, not cookie parts, robotic parts, to look like a cookie. You're a cookie droid. Delicious bear jellies, dangerous jelly bugs. Indeed, you're learning. I love that she's she is slightly above Ion Cookie in terms of understanding the world, because Ion Cookie is entirely artificial. And then I also had seen on Twitter that, like, uh, uh, cookie, cookie Droid is like, oh, wow, you are like me, to Cyborg Cookie, and Cyborg Cookie is like, no, I used to be a cookie. I'm not entirely robot. I'm just, I'm part, I'm part robot, part cookie. Yeah. So, <laughs> Cyborg is annoyed at Android. I, I like that. I like the fact that they, um, it's not like Dragon Ball where they call the androids cyborg, uh, they call the cyborgs androids. It, it's different because they're not entirely robotic. So, I like that the, they acknowledge the difference with this. I was, in the background of some stuff I've been doing, I've been re-watching or re-listening to what do you call them? Uh, like, Totally Not Mark's videos on Dragon Ball and some Dragon Ball Z abridged stuff. Because um, I've been working on a whole lot of things. Coins, crystals, I've heard of those. They're money. <laughs> and I've heard of money. Uh, I, In the meantime, when everything has been stressful and I'm just like, I need a break, I will listen to something in the background and then try and keep up with uh, Cookie Run. I have still fallen behind on a number of things where I could do more. Like, I've basically given up on trying to do the treasure event for, for this. A lot of, lot of stuff going on in, in life. I've just been able to keep up with this. And that's pretty much all that I've been able to keep up with. 
I still have a lot of stuff to do. I, I, I still need to play Cookie Wars before they completely disable it. I haven't been able to do that yet, because I've the uh, this has been basically the only other thing that I've had free time for or, or trying to do in my free time besides trying to render uh, some extra episodes. And even then, I had worked on getting an episode stockpile, at least, and depleting some of that. So I do apologize for some of the lackluster videos recently, but I hope I'm able to make up for it a at least a little bit. Uh, all right, now let's do the event before I, s I talk your ears off even more. The Dreamy Cookie Land. Nope, I don't get the cutscene again. All right, basically the cutscene is that this, ma this is a magical wonder park, but better than the Nickelodeon movie Wonder Park, where somehow Muscle and... Uh, Adventure Cookie became kids, a.k.a., uh, excuse me, that's how you got the warrior tight costume. Uh, so that's, that's how it works. That's, that's what, what's going on here. Let's enter. Open some 25 bears. Okay. I must have for something or other. Must have is at the package shop. The happiness gauge. There we go. That's, that's the legendary, uh, one spirit potion you can get from this. Okay. Wow, this is the reward. Yep, those are good rewards. Those are worth worth going for. All right, let's see. We have to play in Dreamy Cookie Land. Although I'm glad I kind of waited for this because apparently it was really hard before and uh, Dev Sisters adjusted it. So let's give it a shot. Let's see what we can get from this. Ooh, just by playing we get Firecracker and um, the little Shmuchki cookie. Oh, wait, I can get those just right off the bat. Oh, wow! For already upgrading Firecracker, I get all these rewards. I thought I was gonna- I thought that was, like, the gray receive button for a second there. No, no, that's- that's the- that's the one that we can get. Excuse me, I thought it was like the gray receive, where I was like, oh, okay, so we can get those going forward. No, we got those. All right. We already have four out of the happiness gauge so far. That's awesome. All right, let's see what we can do for this. These Firecrackers don't need fire to shine. Look at this beautiful land. Look at this beautiful land. Let's go fire away at the arcade. Pew pew pew. Pew 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 pew. Oh wait, is this? Oh no, wait. She does have an ability. Wait, did Firecracker get a buff? These are a lot more of the tinier ones than I remembered. Does she get a special ability on this stage? Because her ability is different. Look at these cute little aliens. Oh! So they adjusted her ability. I think they adjusted her ability, at least, to make it like this. So that this way, it's half level, half minigame. So it's sort of like they brought back the minigame. Like the, the mini games they did before, but also mixed it in with levels. Alright, this is cool. This is This is an interesting combination. I like it. Gotta try and follow those in order to get the points. They move a little bit differently than they uh, they do in her normal ability, which is only slightly annoying. But it also adds to the challenge of it, which is still cool. Because now you, it's, it's like a shooting range. You gotta try and aim for it correctly. Oh, was that a rocket? Or did it just not become translucent? Is that something that could have hurt me? That thing that j I flew past. Oh good, that one didn't move. Thank you. Oh, yep. No, no. Those are rockets that can hurt me. Yep. They did not. They were not. That was not a glitch. Those are things that can hurt me. I guessed correctly. Okay. These little aliens remind me of the ones from Toy Story. I like them. Come on. Come on. Come on. Blast. Here we go. Oh, I just realized. Are, are treasures not allowed in this in this area? Or did I just not equip a treasure? I don't know. Also, if my voice is a little bit off, again, allergies. I am just drowning in mucus. I've been drowning in work. I've just been drowning in a whole lot of things, including my, my partner for uh, the, the, the term group project that we had to work on. We've both been dealing with a lot of family stuff going on. I won't go... I mentioned some stuff on my Twitter. I won't go into full detail about it. Um, but family stuff has been happening. Child services was called again, and again they are incompetent and do nothing. You'd think that they would, but they don't. It's stupid. Um, 
again, I've talked to, I've ranted about it on Twitter, um, so I won't go into it as much here, but, like, it's been, oh, it's been rough dealing with my father, and I can't even get a break out of the house for at least a short time, um, it's, it's been, well, I mean, I, I, I get this, I get this time when he's out of the house for just a, uh, just a, well, not a sec, but just a couple of, well, it's, it's, it has been a few more than a couple of minutes, luckily. I, I guess he is going to the store afterwards. He wasn't sure if he was, so. All right. Um, I only get this on a, that, that's what I was, my mind was, a couple of days. Only on a couple of days does he actually go out without also making me come with him. Um... So I I was I'm able to do this, which I am glad. So we shall try to get through this. Hopefully everything'll be bliss. Maybe we can get lots of points. Galaga Space Invader Joints Yes Do it for the rhyme. Do it for the rhyme. I got hit. No. Oh, I got revived. Okay. I... I wasn't expecting that. Yay! Is that... Was that added because of, um... Was that what the Dev Sisters added to make it a little bit easier on people to try and, like, revive you if you do a thing? Or did, was there a shop somewhere here and I bought a revive? I don't know. Oops, I got hit by the thingy. Whoops. At least Pac-Man was there to help me. We got a lot of money from this. This is a good place to try and grind for coins on. Emerald, top 9%. Yay! Oh, Apple's buff. Revive with 42. Oh, okay. I didn't read that. Ooh, we get a bonus reward. Hopefully... Oh, wait, I'm not streaming. Yay, it won't crash the stream. This is a thing... Great dynamite! How many other people have been getting these ads for the casinos because of all the people who are at home? So they're just like, yeah, yeehaw, go to our casino, blow up the dynamite. There was one that was funny because they were doing like a, a live machine and they pressed it and they didn't win the first time. They messed it up. They like they, Somebody just randomly tapped on squares and it messed up, so then they cut two footage like they, they they did a crossfade into the footage of somebody winning oh it was it was the same place the gold fortune casino they got like three peaches um and they didn't win but they were like oh look at the three peaches that you can win and it's like no no you you showed that the machine you can't just win by randomly tapping this they had to cut to a take when somebody actually won it's just how fake they are because because the ads are just like look at what you can win just by playing the game see you can win! And it, you're not really winning much. <laughs> Let's see the prize. Ooh, we got a bunch of things. Yay! A little far off from getting the diamond, but eh, we'll be able to get there eventually. Oh, wait, we just got emerald. We're a little far off from getting the ruby. Okay. Well, I can, I can come back to do some more of these. Ooh, repel a bunch of enemy invaders. Invader Zim. I'm just going to collect all on these. There we go. Oh, cool. All right, we can get a lot of these by just doing the repelling enemy invaders. Yeah, let me read the instructions. Cookie space shooter. The cookie skill lasts longer and activates more frequently. Enemy invaders will continue to appear one by one. The boss will not appear. Indestructible missiles detected. Dodge them. One more, the more you, Oh, the more you repel, the faster you become. I didn't realize that. Longer the playtime, the more missiles appear. Okay, good no. Pudding, the rhythm star. Skill lasts longer, more rhythm notes. Ooh, hit the rhythms in a bunch to get uh, to get the combo ability. Muscle, more kettlebells. You see the kettlebells scattered throughout the map. Oh, that's why his ability is extra useful, getting more kettlebell points, because you destroy more with the kettlebell uh, with the event. Okay. Comes more difficult the further you run, but more obstacles to destroy... Magic candy is temporary disabled. Oh, it's temporary. Okay. I was wondering with the with the barbell that you end up throwing. Okay, interesting. I like that they're uh, adjusting this stuff. Okay, and there's apple cookies buff. My apple cookie. Oh, 
I get a different buff depending on how strong Apple Cookie is. That's awesome! I like this event. This is cool. Is he home? Yes, he is home. I'm going to have to leave this here, but this was fun, friends. I'm glad I got to show this off. I'll try and continue it. At some point, I might try and go downstairs and record um, some more of this in the future. We'll see. But for now, I believe it's that time again, friends. If you like what I do, don't be shy to give a thumbs up. Have a pleasant day, everyone, and this is Handington signing off. Bye.